What do Mark Zuckerberg, Sergey Brin, and Lady Gaga have in common? The answer may surprise you. They were all above-level testers when they were young. They joined millions of other students who have taken an above-level test in the last 50 years. So you might be asking, what is above-level testing? It is exactly what it sounds like. Give a younger student a test that was developed for older students. Why take an above-level test? How is this meaningful? Above-level tests can help reveal your child's actual performance level. Often grade-level tests are too easy for high-achieving and gifted children, since most regular tests are designed to measure whether students have learned grade-level material. But they don't spend much time measuring whether students have learned more than that. We call this phenomenon a ceiling effect. Above-level tests remove the ceiling to show the full extent of how much students know. Here's another way to think about it. Imagine we want to measure the height of every child in a class, and we decide to use a four-foot ruler to take these measurements. Would we be able to accurately measure the height of every child who is below four feet tall? Definitely. But what about the children taller than four feet? What information would we be missing about them? Would we say they are all four feet tall, even though there is clearly a difference in heights? Would we guess and hope for the best? Even within one classroom, we might find that our ruler cannot measure every child accurately. However, if the ruler could expand to six feet, seven feet, or even greater, we can measure each child's height precisely. Above-level testing can provide this type of accurate information for a student's academic ability level. The more we know about what students are ready to learn, the more equipped we are to offer appropriate curriculum challenges and enrichment opportunities.